just busy there at the Space Center. Businesses around the Space Coast are bouncing back once again thanks to the surge of space flight. Now, one business in particular, a landmark in these parts, is now busier than ever. News 6 anchor Justin Warmoth paid them a visit. For 30 years, going to work was a sense of pride for Jerry Mulberry. It was exciting to just go to work every day. Mm -hmm. The whole thing about being a part of something that's history is just awesome. When the space shuttle program started in 1981, Mulberry was hired as a quality engineer, working just a few feet away from the crown jewel of American spaceflight. Having a shuttle launch is kind of like having a Super Bowl in your backyard mm -hmm. every so often. And that's what it was like, you know. You'd come in and it, it's just a crowd of people and, you know, they're lining the causeways to see the launch. Go for main engine start. But on July 8, 2011, the space shuttle soared for the last time. Two. One, zero, and liftoff, the final liftoff of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. The end of the program meant Mulberry and thousands of his colleagues were out of a job right in the middle of the recession. The good news for him, his wife was running their t-shirt store called Space Shirts a few miles south of the Space Center. Was there concern that you may have to close or, or were you going to stay open regardless? I think we were diversified enough with our customers that we would not have to close. Mm -hmm. You know, if you think about it, a print shop and a customer embroidery, they do that everywhere. But for other shuttle workers, it wasn't as smooth. At its peak, Brevard County's unemployment reached to almost 12%. Tammy Mitchell works at Space Shirts and remembers the economic downfall. It devastated a lot of my a lot of my friends and family and the, most of them ended up moving away because they just they couldn't make it and it was it was really sad and it's like it felt like almost like a ghost town. Yeah. Ignition. But thanks to the rise of commercial space companies, the jobs they're bringing back to the Space Coast, and the volume of launches, the economy is now thriving. That's also the case here at Space Shirts. And when you throw in the 50th anniversary of the Apollo moon landing, they say it's never been busier. We can't print them fast enough. Really? We cannot print them fast enough. <laughs> cannot. It's, it's like I said, it's, it's insane. It's Proof that Brevard County is back to being the epicenter of space flight. New six. Yep, there you go. And look at this. I got the shirt right here to prove it. Look at that. That's yep. a great looking shirt, too. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, OK, three. Yeah, this is not my size. It's not a crop top. Um, <laughs> but they have plenty uh, at Space yeah. Shirts. It's only like eight miles. Uh, south of the Kennedy Space Center. It's one of the last businesses before you do get to the Kennedy Space Center. And a lot of people go there, uh, camps, but if there's a launch or something, they certainly see an uptick oh, yeah. in people. And they say they have a better selection than the uh, visitors complex. Well, there you so go. That's well, why people hello. are always looking for the shirts. They have, they do all their own designs. It's you really cool. You can get the throwback designs as well. Some yeah. of those previous missions. Yeah, and, the shuttle yeah. launches, they have a shirt for each shuttle launch. Nice. That's great. Um, they would design it off the patch because he worked, Jerry, uh, the owner of Space Shirts, worked um, as a quality engineer on the shuttle during the shuttle program and he would, he told me astronauts and their families would come in in the 80s and 90s and mm -hmm. um, he misses that aspect but he's certainly very excited about where space mm -hmm. program's going now. Yeah, and I know when you first moved here, you lived or started working at New 6, you mm -hmm. worked in Brevard County and lived there, so mm -hmm. certainly nice to see those changes over the years you've been here. Absolutely. So many businesses have popped up, new yeah. restaurants. It's just, it's thriving. I mean, you heard the unemployment rate in Brevard County when the shuttle program ended in 2011, it spiked to 12%. It is now mm -hmm. lower than 4%. Wow. Which is great. And it's just, it's really cool. And um, later on this afternoon, you're going to meet someone who has a new business, a new restaurant in Titusville. And he says that he has the number one location for his pizza shop. You'll, you'll see why. <laughs> and you'll see why. It is, it is in a prime location. So... The Space Coast is back, and, it, right. and it's awesome to be to see it all happen right in front of us. So. New life, yes. New life, Thanks. absolutely.